Music World, Miss Juice here, back for another great installment of I Do Music. It is the month of July, and this month we are talking about working your way up from the bottom to the top, from those internships to the paid gigs. Another great showcase, as well as opportunities for my producers out there to showcase their beats. And all my freestylers, of course we have that freestyle battle for you as well. Of course we have a great panel lined up with industry professionals who are knowledgeable on how to get you to where you need to go. This month we have Brittany King, executive assistant to Chris Hicks, Francis Crawford, co-founder of McGinty Crawford Management, as well as client relations coordinator at Patchwork Recording Studios. Fatima Ebong, Vice President of a &R of Convict Music, Avita Kegler, Entertainment Attorney and Drift City Records, and Angela Young, Manager at Patchwork Recording Studios, all lined up to teach you how to get to where you need to go as an independent artist. And I don't know where you are, the energy is crazy in here, we're networking, we're creating opportunities for ourselves, and we are empowering musicians. Where are you? It's I Do Music. All right, Music World, we're back with another one of tonight's performers. This time it's a duo, and I'm a lucky lady right now. I'm between two very handsome gentlemen. Uh, they're two members of Perfect Dissonance. So um, what made you feel like I Do Music would be the perfect fit for you all to showcase your music? Well, we felt like this was a good, not only was it just a good atmosphere to go in, but we've heard so much about it. Like, this is a big event as far as if you're an artist and you really do music in Atlanta, this is where you need to be. So we were like, man, we need to go ahead and get out here so we can join this 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 prestigious caliber of hotness. So we just felt we wanted to come out here for that reason and also because we know I Do Music is a great networking atmosphere. And we're real big on networking right now because we're still in the midst of trying to create a team. We're still looking for a manager, a publicist, because it's all just us right now. So we, we real big on networking right now. So we figured, why not kill two birds with one pelican? That's just where we at. All right now, who is Glory? Glory is a girl who does classical music. I was trained at piano, I was playing in opera, I play guitar, um, I also dance, I pop, lock, and break. Um, I'm very versatile, very versatile. And um, I'm just a girl, I can give you I can give you classical, I can give you an opera show, or I can give you, like, you know, get bucked, you know what I'm saying? I can give you anything like that. You have it all, you got it all. I'm curious, you know, you got the guitar on your, on your back. What's going on tonight? What we, what we got to look forward to with your performance? Well, I'm going to be playing my acoustic, and I'm going to be playing an, an original piece. Um, so yeah, I'm going to rock out. I'm going to have fun on stage. Hey everybody, this is Zayani. Going to bring something great to the stage. And of course, we're here at IG Music. In this business, you really have to stay true to yourself. This is a business that you get in and you can start losing your identity. Once you're good at what you do, you'll start noticing you go out and somebody will wave at you and you're like, I don't know him. But he probably knows you because your work or your reputation has preceded you. Although they may not want to be an executive as an artist or a producer, you still should know the business side of it so that you don't get screwed. Never think you're too good to do anything if it's the smallest thing. Um, your work ethic keeps you where you are and it makes you stand out as an individual and not make you blend in with the crowd. What I do tell my clients is you have to become project focused. I'm talking about Michael and Quincy, Missy Timbaland, Aaliyah, um, Dre and Eminem. You have to find that creative team to where you all build up one another and instead of making people like us your ultimate audience, you're making the consumers your audience as well. So by the time you approach someone like us, not that we're just like you, we're just on the stage, but by the time you approach people who may be able to assist you in your career, you can say this is my movement, this is my team, 
we can identify a group of people who are ready to consume our sound, consume our t-shirts, our tennis shoes, our wristbands. You have to be project focused, which means, as I was talking to her the other day, you gotta get a job. If you don't have a job, go ahead and get you nine to five. It's cool, there's nothing wrong with that. Once you leave your job, go to the studio and just don't sleep. Be safe and be healthy, but nobody sleeps. So that's how you have to look at it. You have to build projects. Movements is kind of cliche, but you understand what I'm saying. So placements is cool, but don't make that your focus because you'll be in the same spot a year from now, two years from now.